your jungle. Standard Bank has a long history with supporting the arts, uh, the visual and performance arts. Uh, the Standard Bank Gallery itself is celebrating its 30th anniversary, um, but our involvement with the arts is now four decades. If I may just talk about the Standard Bank Young Artists, it is through this platform that um, we've been able to champion support, make visible some of the great uh, artists that South Africa has seen, uh, the Sbongile Kumalos, uh, the Brahews, uh, the, the Kenridges. It's just been an amazing way of ensuring that the arts get the support that they so desperately need. Um, we've also, through the support uh, of the National Arts Festival, contributed to the success and longevity of uh, these key um, art platforms. Because let's face it, uh, any society benefits even more than it appreciates from the arts. So for corporates like ourselves, to play a part has been a privilege uh, in many ways. The Standard Bank Gallery was for me a very important place in uh, Johannesburg and in South Africa because it's a place where I have discovered so many artists. So when we had this idea of this exhibition, Lumière d'Afrique, which presents 54 art pieces from the, each country of the continent, of the 54 countries, it was obviously evident for me that the exhibition has to be here in the Standard Bank Gallery because for me it's a, the most uh, popular place for African contemporary and modern art here in South Africa. So it was very important for me just to present these 54 new artists because you have one from South Africa, Atipatra Ruga, that of course you know, but you can discover 53 different African, con African artists. So I think it's very important just to show that the artists in Africa are all wonderful and they are all very powerful. And usually we forget how powerful art can be. And in this ex exhibition, it shows you and they oblige you just to stay for a while and to have some interrogation. What can I do for Africa? What can I do for people living in Africa? And to develop a free access to energy for everyone. And I think this is a, a huge point of this exhibition. Of course, all the artists can answer in different ways with different media different textures, it can be sculptures, painting, uh, videos, everything. It's, it's very, you know, artists are free, so they can do what they want. But what is very important, as a visitor, you have just to stay in front of each piece and just ask you, what did they told me? H how can I just explain to my friends, to my children? How can, you know, you have light everywhere in Africa, but it's so strange that you do not have power. And that's a huge question that everybody is just wondering why. And I think all the artists are just asking the same question. And I think if everybody is keep asking the same question at the end, you know, people will have to answer to that question. So that's the point of this exhibition. And after that, you just enjoy the visit. I'm very happy to have my show in Johannesburg, in Standard Bank here. So my, my work is uh, that between and um, conceptual and in, uh, in documentary. In me, in, um, uh, the new generation of photography need to show the Africa. Because Africa is um, developed, uh, we need to show the mutation, the mutation in Africa. I tell in uh, new generation artists in Africa, take power to show in the world for your mind, to, to need to, to tell in the world, this is my vision. Vision is not reality, vision is uh, 
is um, in the reality lab in the heart, you know. For more stories like these, go to www.social-tv.co.za. Subscribe to us on YouTube and follow us on our social mediums.